Hello, Robometrics is back with another video. In this video, we'll focus on moving the turtle bot around. The turtle bot will keep on going forward until it reaches an obstacle. And if it does so, it'll turn in an angle and keep on going forward. This is a very simple and easy example of how to write a publisher and a subscriber in same note. So let's get into it. So the first thing would be launching our turtle bot in a gazebo environment. So we'll do so by launching the turtlebot underscore gazebo package and launching the turtlebot underscore world dot launch. This is done exactly in the same way like we have done in our previous videos. That is, we have done so using the turtlebot underscore simulator, which has a turtlebot underscore gazebo. So to the next part of the a video will go to how to move or how to write the publisher and subscriber. My that folder, my that file is present inside the turtlebot underscore tutorials just like previous videos inside scripts and I have move and avoid. So I'll open the code. So this is our simple code. I need, I'm importing raw spy. I'm importing geometry underscore messages dot message import twist this is necessary for for my command velocities this topic command velocity can be different if you have cmd underscore well and if you don't you can use this one you can check it out just like we have done in our previous videos so now the fun part here is i have defined a subscriber and a publisher okay so to check what is the message type for slash scan, we do ROS topic echo, ROS topic info, sorry, ROS topic info and scan. So this gives me sensor messages laser scan. Exactly that is what we have imported. And we write laser scan and this is our callback function. Then we define the publisher and then we do rospy.rate and we do move.twist. Move dot twist is our way of defining our method twist. So let's get into the callback function. This line is basically it, it's what it prints on the terminal. And this is my logic. So my logic is don't focus on message on range right now. I'll come to it later on. So the logic here is it keeps on going forward if my laser data is greater than distance to obstacle which is one and if it's less than or equal to it turns around in the z direction that is move dot angular dot z if you don't understand what this move dot angular dot z is go back to our previous video and writing how to publish the velocities to turtlebot and yeah this will print in and out and uh, so yes, the fun part, message dot range is, that is 300. What is this? So message is basically the whole uh, publish uh, subscriber which I'm getting and after which I'm taking the dot ranges. Ranges is basically a list of all the laser scan readings. But why 300? Let's understand that. So when you do ROS topic info scan, echo scan what do we get oh my god so many values so let's understand that this is what my ranges is you can see here ranges this is the list which i'm accessing the snag data understand is basically because whatever reading is there it's above the range underscore max that is it there's no obstacle in its vicinity and it is saying that it is above 10. So we get a 10 here and we get NAN here. Okay. And why there are like around so many readings? So the reason for so many readings are because at every angle increment of 0 0.0016 radians, I have a reading and those readings are for between minus 0.52 to 0.5 
radians that is from minus 30 degrees to plus 30 degrees I have a reading at 0.1 degree that is approximately 600 readings are present. So when you have 600 readings present from minus 30 to 30 degrees we say that approximately at 300 I'll have the reading at my front laser data. So that is how 300 comes into play. And uh, yeah, and then when we allocate these values in the publisher values, that is move.linear.x, move.linear.z, we publish it. That is publisher, which I have defined, dot publish, and the value which I'm publishing, which is move. So this is my callback function for subscriber, which is defined over here. And inside the callback function, I'm publishing it. This is the simple way how you publish and subscribe with the same node that is a subscriber node. Let's see how this runs. So Ross run turtlebot underscore tutorials and I have move and avoid. So I'm getting nan over here. That nan is exactly due to that at front it sees no obstacle. So to see how the NAND changes, let's put something over here and see. So it changes, right? And it's above, so it keeps on going forward. And if less, then it does not. I'll move it again here. And then it changed. That is how it's changing. So this was a very simple example of how our turtle bot keeps on going by reading the sensor data values and moving around, writing a publisher and subscriber in the same note. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any further doubts, please let us know. Till then, keep watching, subscribe and like our videos. Thank you, Robometrics.